by not dying. her off. You think she'll be okay? I need to know she's gonna be okay. Oh, I'll keep an eye on her. But only if you quit with all the crying. I can't stand a weepy man. Yeah, yeah, I'm okay. I'll be okay. Uh, I should really be heading back to town, though. It's getting dark. You do know the Bellex become more aggressive in the moonlight, don't you? Huh. Well, damn. Don't you know anything? Ugh. Now look, I don't usually extend this kind of hospitality, but I think you'd better stay the night at my place if you want to make it back to town in one piece. Oh. Okay. Do you have, like, a guest bed or something? Nope. town and just didn't have it in me to leave it to suffering bella was my best friend till sheriff said she was too dangerous so i let her loose in the forest hardest day of my life now that sheriff's gone though i'd love to get her back that old crone oletta should know where bella's at hey oletta trying to reunite titus with his pet bella know where she is of course i do She's at Ginfor Grotto. I've got some foraging, so I'll take you to Bella's den. Try and keep up. Well, don't keep me waiting. I know I lost a reel somewhere near there. Keep an eye out for it. The company may have ruined this planet, but at least I got a movie out of the deal. This here's a tour de force, a triumph. Why, you might even say it's my masterpiece. Once this beauty hits the silver screen and I get one of those shiny little statuettes, everyone in the six galaxies is gonna say, Katsuhiro Jones, now that guy could make a movie. to find Bella? It was a real sorry sight the day Titus came to release Bella. Waterworks like you wouldn't believe. That boy's got a soft spot in him. Too soft for Gehenna, anyway. But I saw how he doted on her, and, well, I can't say it wasn't endearing. As it turned out, Oletta wasn't all hard edges after all. Imagine that. sure I want to know. There are some mysteries we ain't meant to know. We need to draw Bella out of her lair. Get some prime devil meat as a lure. There are some feisty devils that dwell in the cave system up ahead. Magnificent specimens. 
butchered them for some grade A devil steaks. Careful, though. Some are radioactive as nuclear waste, and the others are coursing with electricity. Take the bed, because Bella ain't exactly picky. Bella was a runt when Titus set her loose. I didn't think she'd last a day, but now she's made of herself a matriarch. Girl's got some fight in her, no question. We'll see how she reacts to you. No promise. <laughs> Hunter was thinking that electrified meat might be the way to go. They gathered up all the radioactive meat, too. It's always nice to have options. <laughs> the Vault Hunter knew what to do. It was time to draw Bella out of her lair. But Bella weren't so itty-bitty no more. The Vault Hunter watched, hoping this would work. And what do you know? She took the bait. Now Bella seemed friendly enough, but would she take to Titus' scent after all these years? Vault Hunter placed the pants on the ground. Titus's pants smelled like dreams deferred and a yearning for something lost. Also, days old hotcakes for some reason. Looks like she missed Titus as much as he missed her. But the local Bellocks didn't take too kindly to their matriarch turning her back on them like that. I am perfect. I'm ready for a fight. Ha! Down you go! She was following a scent on the breeze. Hell of a nose on those bellies. Fault hunter tail to make sure she made it.
Well, look at you, girl. What a specimen. Yeah. But there's someone back in town who misses you. You remember Titus, don't you? Is that another pair of Titus's pants? Okay, where do you keep getting these? Hey, I said don't ask, didn't I? You ready to go, girl? Now you're talking to it? Uh, does it understand you? Let's just say it's part of my charm. At any rate, I'm sure Titus will appreciate what you've done. I'll pick up the reward from Titus when I get into town. Here's your cut. Let's go, Bella. You haven't forgotten your way back to town, have you? Oh, come on. I'll show you. Vault Hunter decided to go spelunking through the core mines looking for explosives. The company wasn't all scientists in suits. A lot of folk worked these mines back in the day. Work paid well for what it was. Still, plenty who went down into Gehenna's heart never came back up into the sun. Your slave! Ready to unleash this Looking at him, but they sure packed a bunch. So, you made it through the forest. Well, good for you, but it doesn't matter. You're just a bounty hunter and still don't understand how it works around here. There's only one thing strong enough to tame Gehenna, and I'm about to hatch it. Ah, 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 ah! 
got damn near broken teeth in for it. Creep. My veins. Nailed it! Those bombs were looking mighty handy, laced with refined core for a bit of extra oomph. The Ruiner was my grandmother's project, you know. She put her heart and soul into it. Then the company got cold feet. But I'll finish what she did. Bring her dream to life. Then Gehenna will be mine, and there won't be anyone fool enough. Electric car hide looks like just the thing. 